Hello, race fans, and welcome back to the More Freedom Series. Today we have traveled to the Las Vegas Motor Speedway for the Las Vegas 80. This is going to be race number 21 in the More Freedom Series Season 4. And with half, about half the season to go, points race is heating up. Let's go through your top 10. Your points leader is the double zero of Mudbone. Second's going to be the 20 of Adam B5000. Third will be the 544 of Frederick Winklevom. Fourth will be the 11 of TC Roberts. Fifth will be the 49 of Jetman. Sixth will be the 88 of NM. Seventh will be the 799 of Mike Check. Eighth will be the 25 of JTM. Ninth will be the 95 of Zed Brunna. And rounding out your top 10 will be the 40 of Veteran Chaos. We'll check in on your team and chassis standings. With an arrow margin over Douche Motorsports, MBR leads the way. Douche Motorsports second. Ace is at Motorsports third. Amish Buggy racing fourth. And running out your top five would be the Drop Bear Racing Team. Chassis standings look like this. Dodge, Chevy, Toyota, and Ford. So that's a look at all things points here for this Las Vegas 80. <laughs> Always going to remember how, how long this thing was. So they're getting these cars wound up, fired up, ready to go. And I think it's about time, so let's go racing. Let's go through your starting top 10 today for this Las Vegas 80. Starting on the pole will be the 51 of AJM. And, in, and on his outside, the 71 of Kung Fu Beer. Starting third will be the 420 of Queen of Hearts. And on her outside, the 40 of Veteran Chaos. Starting fifth will be the 25 of JTM. And on his outside, the 72 of Duchess. Starting 7th will be the 211 of Hogs, and on his outside, the 666 of Pistol Pete. Starting 9th will be the 07 of Douche Baggins, and rounding out your top 10 will be the 20 of Adam B5000. So that's a look at your top, starting top 10 today for this Las Vegas 80. We're going to see what AJM can do here with the KFB on his outside right now. And with behind KFB is going to be his lone teammate this year, the 40 of Veteran Chaos. So both Kager racing cars starting in the top five. We'll see if those two Fords can get it hooked up here at Las Vegas and see what they have for that 51 of AJM. That beautiful orange and black Dodge Challenger pace car is ducking into the pits. Coming down, leading us to the green flag is going to be the 51 of AJM. Green flag is out and we are underway. <laughs> 420 of Queen of Hearts already battling for the lead right now with the 51 of AJM as the 25 of JTM right to her back bumper. She's going to slide a little bit. He almost gets into her as they come off of turn four down to the front stretch. The 420 of Queen of Hearts going to be leader on lap number one. I'm trying to find our cars here. I was pushing the wrong buttons to switch cameras there. As the 40 of Veteran Chaos now battling with that 25 of JTM. He's going to take away the top position as Hogs gets ready to move into the second place. Let's bring up your timing and scoring. As always, top 10 will be on your left. Favorite driver scrolling across the top. We've got 52 laps of hope, 54 laps of hopefully green flag action here today. As the 40 of Veteran Chaos pushes that car out to the lead. You remember, as you recall from the Monday race, the 25 of JTM pulled out a win there in the IROC series as he's fallen back right now through the field. Again, the low line is going to be the preferred line here at las vegas as we watch that 40 of veteran chaos out to the lead 660 of garrett miller who started 13th is now up to the fourth position already as we see that 25 of jtm and getting trying to get underneath his teammate the 90 the 49 of jetman as his other teammate the 96 of nico rides behind him nico not wasting any time he's trying to work to the bottom of the track here under his teammate the 25 of JTM as we watch the 13 of King of the Aces now underneath the 23 of Fuller than you followed closely by that 33 of Harvey Jones so Nico has pushing his car trying to get it to the front of the field as he started 15th it looks like the 13 of King of the Aces sliding trying to slide in underneath him here Nico stays down at the bottom of the track as we see the 40 of Veteran Chaos still your leader right now with that 211 of Hogs 
for Douche Motorsports right to his back bumper. We do have smoke and whatnots going on right now. We're going to see if we can catch up to see what may have happened. That may have been the four. Oh, it looks like it involves the three of Geek Girl Games as she comes into the pit. So G3 early pit stop. Looks like she's got some right, some major right side damage right there. Looks like that's going to involve the 544, the 777, and possibly the 07, a douchebag. And so a four-car melee. And we might check that replay out in just a bit as we see the 40 of Vetri Chaos still leading this race. As now that 96 of Nico is down to the inside of the 49 of Jetman. Following him along is that 13 of King of the Aces. So Nico starting in the 15th position. He's working his way now into the fourth position, fifth position. Trying to make his way to the front of the field. The 13 of King of the Aces is going to have something to say about that, I think, off of turn two here. Coda trying to get to the bottom. Make a run on this 96 as we see the 211 still riding behind the 40 of Vetri Chaos right now. 49 of Jetman, a uh, little bit, I don't know if he's pushing through the turns, but I think he's getting a little bit of a push through the turns. We're going to see if they can figure that out with the pit stops as we see the three wide battle between the two, the 23, the 420, and the 33. As we watch that 25 at JTM trying to get back to the front of this field. Uh, checking in on your points leader, double zero Mudbone started in... The 31st position has now worked his way up to 15th. So I don't know. I think Mudbone likes that last to first kind of deal as he starts in the second to last row today. Check back up here on your leaders as we see the three of Geek Girl Games who is two laps down right now to the field as the 544 and the 777 going to get put a lap down. So she's a little bit slow here. As the 40 of Veteran Chaos basically trying to push her around the track. To the outside he goes. As we got four wide back here, precariously four wide right now between the 300, the 211, the, six, the 660. As the 96 of Nico down to the inside of all of these, he is trying to get to the front, lead this race as the 40 of Veteran Chaos is your leader right now. The three of Geek Girl Games sandwiched right now. So she's going to be off the pace a little bit here, even though her car doesn't look too bad as the 96 of Nico goes into the second position as we do have a caution on the track, folks. Caution on the track with the 40 of Veteran Chaos as your leader. It looks like that might involve the 20 of Adam B5000, the 777, the 33, possibly the points leader, the double zero of Mudbone. So Vet is your leader right now as we come into the pits. We'll probably check out both of those cautions, see what brought them out as we watch the 40 of Vetri Chaos lead them down pit road. He comes into the pits in the first position, led all 10 laps so far. Queen, well, actually, Queen of Hearts led the first lap, and Vet has led the rest of them as we see multiple cars there on pit road. Nico is into his stall. He is getting service. Here comes that 40 of Veteran Chaos, who again started in the fourth position. Right side, tires going on for the Jack Daniels Ford for Kager Racing. Looks like it's going to be a four-tire stop for that Jack Daniels Ford. As we see the 51 of AJM into his pits, here comes the, the Kager Racing owner, the 71 of Kung Fu Beer. So Vet is out first. Nico is going to be out second. Let's take a look. It right, brought out that caution. We're going to take a look at the first incident here. As you see, it's four wide right now. So let's go ahead and take a quick look at what happened with G3 and these other cars. Wild ride there for Frederick as he got up on his roof on the wall, kept it going. Let's see what brought out as you see them both into the wall. So let's bring, let's see what brought out that caution. So this looks like it's just going to be a racing incident between the 33 at Harvey Jones, the double zero Mudbone. Let's see this caution. So 
So you can see the points leader and second place in points both involved in this caution. Uh, currently both still running, so we're going to see if that changes, but bad break for the double zero Mudbone and the 20 of Adam B5000. Let's go through your current top 10. Your leader is the 40 of Veteran Chaos. Second's going to be the 96 of Nico. Third will be the 211 of Hogs. Fourth will be the 13 of King of the Aces. Fifth will be the 49 of Jetman. Sixth will be the 300 of Resemble. Seventh will be the 660 of Garrett Miller. Eighth will be the 23 of Fuller Than You. Ninth will be the 420 of Queen of Hearts. And rounding out your top 10 will be the 329 of Heck of a Duber. Out of this race as a result of that caution will be the 777 of Seabass. DB, who you saw out there out front, is going to end up a lap down here as he gives up that spot to... He, he has to go to the back of the pack. Um, currently one lap down will be the 33 of Harvey Jones, the 20 of Adam B5000, the 544 of Frederick Winklevom, and the, the three of Geek Girl Games will be three laps down right now. The double zero Mudbone is on the lead lap here. I believe he's the last car on the lead lap. We'll go and take a look at his car as he is your your points leader. Definitely heavy damage on the side of that car and the back. As we get ready to go back to the green flag here, 40 of Venture Chaos gonna be leading us down with that 96 of Nico on the outside. Nico is looking for his first race win in a very long time as well as I think the vet is also looking for his. Um, so bringing him down to the green flag. Green flag is out. We're underway. We're going to see if Nico's going to be able to get that jump right here. So Nico with a great jump into turn one. On the 40 of Veteran Chaos. Vet a little bit slow right now. He's trying to get that car wound up. The 211 of Hogs. Drop it down to the inside with the 40 of 9 of Jetman as we head down the back stretch. Nico out to the lead, the 211 battling right now with the 49, the 40, the 13, and the 420. So Hogs is going to get up into the second position. Your leader right now on the track is the 96 of Nico. They are squirrely here today. It's in the upper 90s here in Las Vegas for this Las Vegas 80 with about 37 laps to go. The 49 of Jetman down to the inside of the 211 of Hogs. So he's going to move into the second position. Right behind him is going to be the 420 of Queen of Hearts and her teammate, the 11 of TC Roberts. As we see the 356 of Ice Cream some days entering the fray here as she had started in the 20th position now top 10 for that 356 of ice cream some days trying to make it three weeks in a row on a top 10 including that win last week so she is working on a good second half to the season right now unfortunately your teammate g3 currently three laps down right now Watch this battle for the lead shaping up between possibly the 49 of Jetman and that 420 and the 96 and possibly the 11 of TC Roberts. This could be a good and wild finish to the end of this race. Your announcer is writing something down right now. As we watch this battle for the lead, So Jetman trying to work to the back bumper, the 96 of Nico. Sorry about that delay right there. I had to write something down as it involved the race. Uh, you know, announcer slash editor of the race there. But the 96 of Nico is leading the way of the 49 of Jetman in second. We're checking back through the field. The 356 of Ice Cream some days into the fourth position as we watch. The 420 of Queen of Hearts down to the inside of the 49 of Jetman. He's working to the outside right now. The 11 of TC Roberts thinking about going with him. I think the 11 is going to go with him right here. So the 49 of Jetman able to keep the second position right now over the 420 of Queen of Hearts as the 11 of TC Roberts working to the outside. As we see that 203 of Signs now getting around the 356 of Ice Cream some days. 
as we watch the 544 Frederick Winklevom rolling roadblock right here. Everybody splitting him as he goes down the middle right there. So Frederick off the pace. That's going to allow a mix up here at the front of the field as we see that 49 of Jetman a little bit higher through the turns right now. As we have about 31 laps to go, your leader still going to be that 96 of Nico. As Jetman working down into turn one and two. Still ahead as we see the 23 of Fuller than you, known a wrecker in the series. He has made his way into the top 10, currently fifth after starting in the 21st position. So, I mean, Fuller's had a great, I don't know, like he's also had a great three weeks or so here in the More Freedom Series. He is working on another top 10, currently 23rd in points the same as his number as he's given a little bit oh give a little bit of bump to the 203 of signs was the 23 of fuller than you again not afraid to use that front bumper is the 23 of fuller than you as checking in on where your pole sitter is right now he's back in the 22nd position So we're watching your leader, the 96 of Nico, as he leads the 49 of Jetman right here. Jetman a little bit, I think he's up a little bit higher in the turn than the uh, 96. And so I think he's got just a little bit of a push still. And I think JTM now, yeah, the, 90, the, the 49 had that a little bit early on as we see just maybe fighting for grip here again. It's 95 plus here at Las Vegas today. So this track is going to be extra greasy as they work around it today couple laps till halfway we're going to see if the 96 of nico is going to be able to lead it halfway here today and secure those additional five bonus points actually watch the battle back here for looks like this is for the sixth position fifth and sixth sixth position the 356 of Ice Cream some days is in a battle right now with a 95 of Zed Brunna aces the Zed Motorsports right here with the 35 or I'm sorry the 95 the 13 and the 420 they're trying to get that sixth position away from the 356 of Ice Cream some days former aces the Zed Motorsports driver as she's trying to catch up to the 203 of signs let's check in on your leader as the 96 of Nico will have led at halfway currently has led 13 laps here today and he uh, 14 laps sorry he is your leader at halfway so the 96 of Nico is working on leading at halfway leading the most laps and getting that five bonus points for leading a lap as he works down to the inside of second place and points to 20 of Adam B 5000 as we see the 23 of Fuller Than You out of nowhere right now, I feel like has now caught up to the 49 of Jetman. So Paul has a fantastic car again today here at Las Vegas, just absolutely driving that car, the wheels off of it right now. And we're gonna check in. We'll see that 11 of TC Roberts who currently runs fourth in points. He is fourth in the field today, so this could be a great points day for the 11 of TC Roberts. He is all, he's actually almost 200 points behind the uh, leader, the double zero of Mudbone. So Mudbone, Adam, and Frederick all running way back in the pack right now as actually Mudbone has now dropped two laps down and has went into the pits. So... Rough go today for the double zero of Mudbone, the 20 of Adam B5000, and the 544 of Frederick Winklevom. As we do see, the 96 is into the pits. And I was just paying attention to the timing and scoring and, every, as, and everything else as we're going to watch the 96 of Nico getting right side tires and fuel left side tires as well for the 96, as we did see the 49 of Jetman also into the pits. So the 96 is down on the way. The 49 is down on the way. Drag race off of pit road for what could be. Nah, I think we got 21 laps to go. I think we'll see another pit stop here today.
So the 96 of Nico coming out of the pits, the 49 of Jetman following him right along here. We'll try to catch up to who was your leader, which would have been the... Probably this 23 of Fuller than you. We're going to see what Fuller does here. So this might set up a... Oh, no, we're going to have... A drag race down the back stretch. This is very familiar for the 07 of Douche Baggins. We saw that with the 23 of Fuller than you as Fuller put him into the wall. So I believe your leader is probably going to be the 96 of Nico. I'm going to try to jump up here to the front of the field as... Yeah, it looks like, I'm sorry, I'm jumping around everywhere on the screen. Uh, looks like the 96 of Nico is currently going to be your leader, but that 49 of Jetman is saying no. This is a drag race down the front stretch. The leader at the stripe is going to probably be the 49 of Jetman here. So Jetman has taken over the lead from the 96 of Nico. I'm just jumping up here to see... If anybody else could be possibly the leader, which uh, looks like Wishbone Attack going to drop out of this race. It looks like he has an engine. His engine goes away, so Wishbone Attack out of the race right now. As we see the 49 of Jetman putting another lap on the double zero of Mudbone here. That's going to hold up the 96 of Nico just enough to get a good uh, run by the 23 of Fuller than you into the turn. So Fuller getting down to the inside of the 96 of Nico. He's going to set his sights on the 49 of Jetman here. So the double zero of Mudbone held up that 96. That's going to allow the 23 of Fuller than you to catch up and make a pass again. We're going to have, I think, one more pit stop here today with 18 laps to go. Uh, they pitted with about 20, I think it was. So we're going to see, at, I think we'll see one more 18 to 20 was that pit stop. And so definitely one more for everybody. And hopefully, yeah, that's going to be very close to the end. So with 17 laps to go, we may see final pit stops with five la under five due to that caution so that caution came after about lap 14 we went another 16 laps so they're going to be very close on fuel at the end of this race I feel like uh, Fuller went one lap farther than the 49 of Jetman as we see the 23 of Fuller than you down to the inside of that 49 of Jetman. So Paul has a fantastic car underneath him again today for Aces to Z Motorsports. He will take over the lead here of the race on lap number 39. As we see the 96 of Nico make that run to the back end of the 49 of Jetman and this could be a Fuel saving maneuver by that 49 of Jetman, and I don't know, we'll figure it out. Basically, in the next 10 laps or so, we'll figure out what's going on. As let's get through your current top 10. So, your leader now is that 23 of Fuller than you. Second's going to be the 49 of Jetman. Third is going to be the 96 of Nico. Fourth will be the 11 of TC Roberts. Fifth will be the 95 of Zed Brunna. Sixth will be the 203 of Signs. Seventh will be the 71 of Kung Fu Beer with the 34 of Super Snake and 8th. Ninth is going to be the 660 of Garrett Miller and rounding out your top 10 will be the 356 of Ice Cream some days. So again, uh, your po points leader, the Double Zero Mudbone, currently runs 27th. Second place, the 20 of Adam B5000 will be 29th. And third place in points, the 544 of Frederick Winkelbaum going to be running 31st. 
I don't think either one of those are in dire straits as far as the points go as maybe TC, if he can continue where he is in the race, currently fourth, will may catapult over possibly second and third, but I don't think he has enough points in the... He'd have to win it. And even then, he's not going to catch the double zero Mudbone. So Mudbone will potentially keep... He will keep the points lead for this race. Um, but it's going to be a close one after that. So we'll jump back up here to the front of the field as we see the 23 of Fuller than Yale still leading the way as he comes down. A little bit of a block right there on the 49 of Jetman. Jetman down to his inside right here as we head down the back stretch with 10 laps to go. Jetman trying to work underneath that 23 of Fuller than you right now. Down to the stripe, the 49 of Jetman is your leader. As we come down into one and two, watching that 23 of Fuller than you and see what the 96 of Nico does. Nico has a little bit of a push you can see here as they head down the back stretch. Nico right to the back bumper of the 23 of Fuller than you. He swings it low, trying to get under Paul to try to get away that second position down the front stretch. Right to his back bumper is the 96. So Paul is holding off the 96 of Nico right now as we watch the 49 of Jetman be your leader here. Again, nine laps to go here in the race. We'll check in on, we'll check back through this field, see what's going on real fast. Mostly single file action right now as we see the 666 of Pistol Pete who currently runs 13th. He died desperately for a good finish here today. Currently 33rd in points. So top 15 right now for that 666. But he's got three douche motorsports drivers around him with the 72, the 329, and the 8 of Moon Bunny. Walk, drop back through the field, see what's going on. There's your pole sitter, the 51 of AJM, who has fallen back to now the 20th position. As we watch the 49 of Jetman dealing with slow traffic there in the form of the 33 of Harvey Jones. With six laps to go, it looks like the 23 of Fuller Than You is probably going to take the lead back over from the 49 of Jetman after that having to deal with the rolling roadblock of Harvey Jones right there as we see the 96 of Nico, who I just feel like doesn't have enough oomph under that car to get around either the 49 or the 23 right now. As we see the double zero Mudbone coming out of the pits right there after his latest pit stop, that's actually gonna put him two laps down, probably three laps down. So the 23 of Fuller than you with about five laps to go here in the Las Vegas 80 has pushed himself back out to the lead right there in front of the 49 of Jetman and the 96 of Nico. So we see pit stops happening right now. We're going to watch the 49 and the 96 as they bring it on pit road. I don't know if they were both just on the brakes right there trying not to uh, speed down pit road as you saw that a little bit of a wiggle between both of them. 49 is into his pits. Looks like fuel only stop for the 49 of Jetman. He's down and he's away. The 96 of Nico's away. So fuel only. A huge gamble here today by MBR taking fuel only for the 49 and the 96. We'll try to catch up to your leader, the 23 of Fuller Than You. As we see, he's into the pits. Probably a fuel only stop for him as well. So 
So TC takes over the lead right there. The 96 and the 49 are going to need a fantastic lap here. There comes the 49. It looks like they're not going to make it out in front of that 23 of Fuller than you. Fuller's got a good head of steam. This might be the way that he wins here. So KFB takes over the lead right now from uh, as the pit stops are happening. I believe the leader is going to be the 23 of Fuller than you once pit stops are over. Watching this action on the track, the 49 to Jetman creeping up a little bit on that 23 of Fuller than you. I think this is actually, wow, a uh, checkered flag. Um... I didn't even notice. I believe and just, I'm so sorry. You're winner because I was so caught up in, in everything. You're winner today. The 71 of Kung Fu beer. He runs out of gas going into the pits. Oh my goodness. I was so caught up in everything that I didn't even realize it was the white flag and then the checkered flag, his first win of his career today, the 71 of Kung Fu Beer. I am, I am so sorry to KFB. I, I didn't even realize it. I'm so excited for him right now. Your winner today here at Las Vegas, the 71 of Kung Fu Beer. Let's go through your finishing order. Again, your winner today is the 71 of Kung Fu Beer. Second place is going to be the 203 of Signs. Third will be the 356 of Ice Cream Some Days. Fourth will be the 13 of King of the Aces. Fifth will be the 72 of Duchess. Sixth will be the 10 of Scooters. Seventh will be the 420 of Queen of Hearts. Eighth will be the 999 of Deviant. Ninth will be the 211 of Hogs. And rounding out your top 10 will be the 51 of Kung Fu Beer. So amazing today. I'm dumbfounded. I, again, I am so sorry that I missed it. As you can see, the 40 of Veteran Chaos also out of gas on pit road here. Your winner is the, the, the 71 of Kung Fu Beer. Uh, if it can't get any more exciting, next week we go to Phoenix for the Phoenix 68. Um, Just, I don't even know what to say. Let's take a look at your current points after that win by the 71 of Kung Fu Beer. Also, let's take a look at your team and chassis standings. We'll see how things shake up there. Wow, what a crazy end. I was so focused on pit stops that I didn't even realize it was the white flag or the checker flag. Um... Congratulations today. First win in his career, the 71 of Kung Fu Beer. It is about time. Season four, finally, finally, KFB is able to win it. An awesome fuel mileage strategy for Kager Racing between himself and also that 40 of Veteran Chaos. As you can see, Vet, who finishes 11th here today, ran out of gas on pit road, and KFB ran out of gas coming on to pit road. So awesome pit strategy here today by Kager Racing. They're gonna, he's gonna, KFB is gonna pull out that win, and I'm so excited for him. Lima Ritas are gonna be flowing tonight in the trailers, and congratulations again to the 71 of Kung Fu Beer. And until next week at Phoenix, take care. <laughs>